So here's a first very rough and ready look at Google's entry into the tablet market. It's a 7-inch device. Uh, it's made by uh, Asus. It's called the Nexus. It's going to be out in the next uh, couple of weeks or so. Um, anyone familiar with the, uh, the Android interface uh, will understand this pretty well. 7-inch, uh, as I said, light. It's got a quad-core processor, which should make it pretty fast, faster than similar 7-inch devices for, for playing games in particular. Everything should happen pretty smoothly. Just going down the bottom here, you've got what you might expect, a whole range of uh, Google services, your, your G, G, uh, G+, social network, YouTube, Gmail and so on. Obviously trying to integrate all that in. Uh, of course it's using uh, Chrome as its, um, as its web browser. Um, uh, there's a bookstore, lots of content. This is one of the interesting things. Uh, they're going to be trying to market lots of content, convince people that they've got uh, a sort of ecosystem of, of content to rival uh, that provided by Apple. Um, so, uh, movies and music and uh, all of it coming via uh, the store, uh, the Google uh, store here. And uh, what will be interesting is how much of this content uh, is available in the UK. Lots of deals being done in the US. How much of it will uh, reach the UK, whether there'll be deals for TV content and so on, we'll have to see. Um, but it looks like a pretty good contender uh, in the tabloid market, which is now getting increasingly crowded. So just a quick look, and I'm going to end with a little experiment uh, to see if I can make the voice activation work. So we'll cut there, and let's have a look at this. Here we go. So that's the Google Nexus tablet, a new entry into what's becoming a crowded market. Will it kill off the iPad? Probably not, but certainly going to provide plenty of competition for cheaper devices. Hmm, not bad.